हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू अनदर क्वेश्चन एविएशन मैथ्स बीएनसी सीरीज क्वेश्चन थर्टी फॉर नेविगेशन द क्वेश्चन स्टेट्स दैट एन एरोप्लेन इज फ्लाइंग एट टैस ऑफ 180 एटी नॉट ऑन अ ट्रैक ऑफ 090 नाइन जीरो डिग्रीज द विंड वेलोसिटी इज जीरो फाइव फोर फाइव डिग्रीज फिफ्टी नॉट्स हाउ फार कैन दी एरोप्लेन फ्लाई आउट फ्रॉम इट्स बेस एंड रिटर्न इन वन आर and the options are as indicated so this question is very similar to a pnr or psr problem that means we have a time of 1 hour which is equal to our endurance and in this endurance how much can the aircraft go and come back given a wind Uh, velocity of uh, wind direction of zero four five and wind velocity of fifty knots. The track is going outwards is zero nine zero, and return would be two seven zero degrees. This would be the track. As we know, PNR or PSR is equal to E O H upon O plus H, where E is endurance, O is outbound ground speed, and H is return or homebound ground speed. so e is given to us which is equal to 1 o and h we have to find out to find out o and h we will use cx3 link for the online version of cx3 is as indicated in cx3 we will first press flight button and after fl pressing flight button we will go to the wind correction field and press enter and we will get these fields so for o we will start putting the values for our outbound leg that means we will put a tas of 180 press enter so track of 090 090 press enter and wind speed of 50 wind direction of 045 press enter and we have got our values in which we want to know the ground speed outbound which is 141.14 knots please remember this figure 141 One four knots. So in our data, we have got E is equal to one. O out ground speed outbound is equal to one forty one point one four knots. Now we will find out H. Once again, we will use CX three for H. Once again, in the wind correction field. p enter and tas continues to be 180 knots press and enter with tas as 180 then go to track in this case the track will be 270 you are returning on 270 so enter 270 because the tas has vanished i'll go back and put the tas as 180 it's enter and now wind speed once again 50 and wind direction as 045 and once again we get a ground speed as 211.85 knots remember 211.85 so h is equal to 211.85 knots now let us put these values in the formula pnr 
pro PSR. So PSR is equal to E into 141.15 into this is one so just put it one and into 211.85 upon 141.11 plus 211.85 so when you solve this equation in the calculator you will get an answer of 84.7 nautical mile which is our answer so you look at our options the closest option is 85 nautical miles which is op option b which is our correct option for this question Thank you for watching the video. Happy landings.